what are delegates in c sharp when to use delegates in real applications now this delegates is a very important con concept for interviews but in real projects i have seen very few projects uh, which use it basically one project i used this in a winform application but all right because it is important we have to cover this so let's see the code first see here inside the class we have two static methods add and mul okay these methods have same return type void and same number of and type of parameters okay now there can be some other methods like this also like subtract divide etc etc now you can see these methods are bit similar so we can declare a delegate calculator for them like this got it so what is a delegate a delegate is a variable that hold the reference to a method or you can say it's a pointer to a function like this delegate calculator delegate is pointing or referencing to this add method second point is a delegate can refer to more than one methods of same return type and parameters okay return type and parameters of all the methods must be same see here is the calculator delegate is pointing to multiple methods but all these methods return type and number of parameters are same now the question is when to use delegates uh, like this see inside the main method here we are instantiating the delegate and passing the method name add as a parameter of delegate and then calling the delegate by passing the other parameters values okay so first we are passing the method as a parameter and then the parameters which the normal parameters of the uh, of that method or delegate so the use of the delegate is when we need to pass a method as a parameter then we use delegate okay similarly here we can replace add with the mul, mul method parameter and then you will get the output like 20 into 30 which is 600 so that's it that is the delegate and the use of the delegate is clear what are multicast delegates now this is a next level question of delegates okay so let's see the code first for example here is the same code which i explained when i explained delegates remember two methods add and mul with same return type and parameters will be referred or pointed by calculator delegate then here we are passing add method as a parameter and then we are passing the values 20 and 30 as the parameter values and it will print 20 plus 30 50 as the output okay that is a simple delegate now what is the multicast delegate if i will simply add this line this is small code this means when this delegate is invoked here then it will first run add function and then it will run multiply function automatically one by one in sequence so single delegate now executing multiple methods at the same time and the output will be like this this is the addition and this is the multiplication so the definition is a multicast delegate in c sharp is a delegate that holds the reference of more than one function that's it easy and simple what are anonymous delegates in c sharp uh, let's see the code first uh, do you see any methods or function here in the class uh, like accept the main method do you see any other method here no right but here we have the delegate declared so what the delegate is doing here delegate is a reference to a method and we have no method here then without the method how can the delegate exist the answer is the method body has been provided in line here see the code between these two curly braces it is the body of the method but there is no need to assign it a name so that is anonymous delegate which refers to an anonymous method an anonymous method means in english which no which has no name a method which has no name only body in line okay so the definition is delegates pointing methods without the name are called anonymous delegates that's it simple what are the differences between events and delegates here i will explain what you have to tell to the interviewer or you have to explain to anyone okay first thing is what is event the event is a notification mechanism that depends on delegates only okay see here delegates depends on function and similarly event depends on delegates that means an event is dependent on a delegate and cannot be created without delegate okay event is like a wrapper over the delegate to improve its security 
now how it is improving this security so if you have ever worked in asp.net win forms then you know this kind of button click events right now actually on that button click event several functions first uh, uh, so several functions in sequence are called by the dotnet framework and that is with the help of the multicast delegates okay but can you see those delegates can you modify those delegates can you modify those function no as a developer you cannot modify those uh, whatever is happening behind the event uh, like what which delegate it is calling which function it is calling you cannot do anything so that is the security which event will provide to the delegate so that the developer or anyone else cannot change the mechanism behind the event so that is uh, how so that is the event it's a notification mechanism and delegates which are used by the events